Who are you? Or they well, close on, what is it? Whatever. I'm Faye, I've been Pokemon Store 719, episode 15. Where is Cubone's bone? Um, in this, uh, Go goes back to his, uh, home. And there's a woman inside his apartment. But I don't know if it's, if it's a grandmother or an aunt or housekeeper or just uh, a colleague of his parents. Yeah, I see it who's uh, those parents in this. And I don't know, they're workaholics. They're some sort of uh, programmers that uh, work a lot and that's uh, probably uh, why God said back in SO3 to SA's Windows type of people. Since I think his parents said, like, say they're gonna do something with him, then work just comes up and uh, they have to cancel. And uh, there's this funny part when that uh, uh, Squirrel Bunny actually uh, drags Go to the Voice back to his uh, place and go out to get the bag of uh, food he was going to bring, and the toast he brings out uh, with him to get to go. And then he goes to the permanent of Go isn't there since he went to the woods where he finds a Cubone being bullied by some monkey. And Cubone loses his bone, and the uh, Go decides to help out with uh, his. Pokemon, which are um, Butterfree, Beedrill, uh, Scyther, and Taylor to help find the monkey to get the bone back. And uh, when Toys just rings on his side to help as well, and they have to corner the monkey, and it turns out they don't have the bone, because it turns out monkey. Uh, he obviously lost it in a river, but thanks to Go's Dugong, he did get it back. And uh, Go tries to see him uh, flying on the Zephyro, I think. And that's him up in the, in the woods where he is. And there's no Go told his parents about the Tosi. And uh, he's all embarrassed the way uh, his parents describe how he uh, told him about Tosi. <sighs> um, turns out he ate the food that he forgot that Asa had and gave to him was actually for his parents as he wanted to share this um, meal with them. And uh, four of them plus their Pokemon actually go to the house and all yeah he actually caught the uh, uh, Cubone. And the parents are said uh, talking to himself of uh, the woman from the uh, area just uh, talking to God and, they're just, and uh, the parents, the parents are saying uh, like, how glad that uh, they are going to go uh, have a friend or something like that. And uh, after that it's there and that's it. Pretty good episode, a bit better than uh, the previous Go episode from episode six, where it's just some them casting different Pokemon, and this gets a uh, more uh, highlight to Go's uh, personality and the and the music uh, that I was playing when he's having Scarbunny about uh, his parents canceling things on was very good. And him not helping out uh Cubone just shows that uh Tatoshi's uh helping Pokemon whenever he can that uh, personality is with off on Go since back in episode also back in episode three he just saw let him uh, that uh Ivysaur uh, do what it wants and not uh and not the uh, Interfere with with it. 
kind of like the keyboard voice in this, and all the other music that was playing in the episode was very good, and I think uh, these are some of the highlights of uh, the Pokemon that go caught so far. Well, I already saw them, I don't think they saw the Cascoon or some of the other of that goes Pokemon, but maybe the song the one they call it in the first few episodes. And, uh, let's just see, uh, I think we're off the, off the good of uh, the Toshi to, to drop off uh, the food that Go forgot. Uh, this one, the relationship between Go and his parents is uh, good as well, maybe to do more episodes like this. And I'm guessing the, the Go Folk episodes are going to be like the soft please ones. They get a bit better with the, each one that goes on. But, I don't know. I'm trying to like go a little bit, but not really that much. But, um, you know. Anyway, uh, next week, uh, Tosi gets uh, cursed by uh, the Gengar from episode 11. And, uh, some people are thinking they might catch it. Mm, I don't know. Like, it was about the uh, number 10 for most popular Pokemon of the year, so I don't know why they wouldn't let him uh, catch it. I don't, know, I don't really know why they have a lot of uh, Gen 1 Pokemon on its team. Even if uh, Mr. Mime is just like a substitute or not in like the main team, in my opinion. And I wonder if uh, Gogo have the cube on his main team or just have him as like a standby member or something. Eh, don't know. But as I said a lot of times, I do hope they give Satoshi an SPR. It deserves it. It'd be cool. Be, it'd be, I mean, it'd be like a mirror in a, a Gladion and Gary and Sosu have an Umbreon. So I think it'd be cool if you had, had a Espeon and maybe a, a Flygon. Or uh, maybe evolve his uh, uh, one of his uh, universe starters. I don't know which one be better to evolve, but, mm, or maybe evolve one of the or fully evolve his uh, a Zoto star since uh, two of them are in the a middle evolutionary stage. Um. Yeah, I don't, I don't know what other Pokemon, he, like with older Pokemon, like he, he can evolve in this, but hopefully they give him some good Pokemon for his, for his team, including the Riolu. Give him Riolu, they've been hinting at it for a long time now, so I hope that when they weren't, that the Pokemon that people, people behind Pokemon were just trolling people. Anyway, yeah, it's like time. I'll see you guys later.